Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to the Journey YouTube channel. This is I, I the Great. Now, this morning we're going to talk about the Metaverse. Most of you all, you know, most internet users right now must hear about the Metaverse where Mark, whatever him have his name, the creator of Facebook and Instagram, him and some other big creators, you know, big white um, um, social media creators, so, so, social networking creators, I talk about this metaverse thing and if you check the levels it's already in effect, it's already in full effect because if you look on whenever you open the app for Instagram or WhatsApp you're gonna see from Meta, you're gonna see from M-E-T-A, Meta which is shortening for metaverse. Now this whole metaverse thing it's not no old scary thing like when we hear some, you know, say, some YouTubers, or some, some spiritual YouTubers I watch, you know, I realize that they put out, they have a lot of, they have a whole fear base, them whole platform is fear base, so it's no different from the religion, you know, they try to create a, a, a little network, a little, a little circle of fear to bring people to view them videos, you know, because, you know, the fear drives the population. Fear drives ma majority of the population, you know, fear. Fear drives majority of the population, believe it or not. Fear is what gets them going. You want somebody to do something, you make them be fearful of something about it. And that's like because we have to get people to move. To drive fear in them. So I realize a lot of spiritual YouTubers I do this to get views. You know, each one to his own. I'm not going to bash nobody, but... The whole metaverse thing, I'm going to show you my point on it this morning. That's what the video is about. So the metaverse, you know, them say the metaverse is a, is a, is a 3D version of the internet. So it's like, you have a the, inter the internet, that to me means that the internet will be more interactive, more, you know, you literally you have to feel more personal on the internet. You can literally, you have literally own avatars where like I can make the human consciousness actually understand itself more because if you go and if you go literally a control a sim of yourself, which is like a cartoon version, a 3D version of yourself in a in a the actual internet world, because you actually you actually have access to your personal avatar in the internet world. You can go shopping and all of them something there. You like can walk up and down in the nature and feel like you actually out there. Because you have on like a, it will be like a simulation. The internet, the internet is gonna become like a simulation, you know, which is what we are currently experiencing right now. We are literally in a simulation. I'm gonna say this in a, in a the video, in a couple of my early videos. Then the life, this life we experience is just merely a simulation. We have on like a pair of glasses. You get to me and say, and we have experienced everything like it real, but it really and truly not real. It's just a simulation. And everything is mental, so I feel like so the whole metaverse thing when I come with now, with your, you have to get our glasses so the, so the cell phones and the laptops will be replaced with just glasses. So you put on the glasses and literally connect your mind to the alternate realities. You know, whatever you want to experience, you want to experience nature, you can literally feel like you are walking in nature, you know. So if me I, if me I create a video like in nature, right, like right here, I can literally invite you to my space and you can literally experience what I experience with the glasses. So you find say, that actually show the human being say that the human consciousness in a big way man and that means say, you see that in a way of speeding up the evolution process. Because if the human being can understand say how them can actually experience reality through an avatar in a 3D way, like the internet go shopping, go places, go parties or whatever. You know, the, just with our glasses, you know, it shows you that the universe really, the universe where we are living at, the experience where we are experiencing, is really mental. Because if our glasses can literally make you feel the water touch your skin and all of that. Just our glasses, you know, it will literally make you feel like everything is everything, you know. Yeah, it's a 3D reality. The internet has turned into a whole holographic thing with you controlling your avatar and experiencing anything you want to experience, like from the, from the comfort of your bedroom. You have to put on the glasses, you get what I say? And the glasses them go, gonna be um, accessible to everybody, same like cell phones today. You know, like the early 2000s, cell phones, cell phones were expensive and everybody could have one. Now everybody and their mama have cell phones, you get what I say? So it's gonna be just like that. Easy access, you know? It's gonna replace the whole cell phone, it's gonna replace the whole digital business that go more like virtual. 
So I got experience a virtual reality for the internet and everything around. Even doing business I got trained. The business aspect of things. It's gonna help um, content creators like we. It help everybody, you know, but me see a big help. You know, I see a big benefit to con content creators like we because you're gonna be able to like interact personally with we people them who follow we, with the followers and subscribers and them thing there. You know, like by literally putting on our glasses, we can keep a meeting right here up on the beach side and everybody come join me. It's gonna be like that, you get me? I say, because as I say, enough even, enough you know, leave your bedroom. I left there, put on the glasses and select where you are. And it's a big, um, you don't have to press nothing, you literally just tell, tell it where you are based by your mind. You can, you can talk to it or you can literally just talk to it through your mind. So you have telepathic communication too. So, I have shown a long time, so this is we live in is magic, you know, brother. Huh? Magic has gone a long time. If you check the levels, we depend on a big ball. Them, a spear. You get me I say? A spear. Out in a space. And the moon literally is a spear, a ball. A, you know, they call it the, the shape of it a, a sphere. But I call it ball for you know, the resonance everybody. So the, when we have a floating ball out of space. And the moon is a floating ball so up around me and then we get energy from the sun which is the next floating ball. And you tell me magic is not real. This is magic, all of this is magic. You plant a seed now the ground and you see it look nothing like the plant. And maybe if you wait a year you see, the, see it from the same seed, the seed will look like this. The seed will look like this. And over time you will see the seed turn now and coconut tree or an almond tree and all of that. Just a seed, you know, and I also say you know, believe in a magic. Magic is all what happens because I'm sure you can't explain how a seed turns into a tree. You can't explain that to me. You get what I say? A magic can go on, man, all the time. You might look for the way the water flows. Why make it flow? Explain that. Magic. The way the water flows from, from the source of the river to the mouth of the river. Where the energy come from? Magic again, all of this are magic, you know. That's why when they say magic not real, you know what I'm to people. You know, you have to believe in the thing if you actually experience it. Cause me believe in a magic a lot. And a whole heap of magic me see happen in my lifetime. A whole heap of magic me see happen in my lifetime, believe me. Yeah, because I'm a person who believes in a magic. I mean, if I become a believer in it, I see so much things. But I see a lot. I see a lot to prove to me that yo, magic is real. And Literally just metaphysics around the earth, around the whole universe. Most of what I'm around here, you can't really explain that in a logical sense. You know? <laughs> yeah, so the metaverse now, I say, it will help um, us content creators to connect more with the followers and subscribers and you know the people who watch your content and all of that. So, I mean, I see that's not big bad nothing we are scared of and scared of and say, oh, it will take away from natural nature. Because a lot of people are already taken away from nature, from, from nature itself. Cause all them do I watch nature on the TV. That's the only nature them get. But you know, it now gonna make people become more lazy. People are already lazy. The internet already make people lazy. And the internet and, and the metaverse can't really make nobody do nothing. If you're lazy, you're just like always lazy. And if there's a person who love love nature, even when they're in the world, so they stay inside. They gonna find a way to get out there. And even when the metaverse force of it, you know. Sit down and can order food from everywhere and just be in the comfort of your house. Outside, I always do this, so you always have an option, you know. So, nothing can really make you do nothing, you know. It's a man says, so even when the metaverse is not fully fake, you can still go outside. And it all get worse before it gets better, people. But I know so the whole metaverse thing, what I'm going with right now, it's a, it's a good look to me, honestly. I see, I see a positive in it, I see a way we can actually connect better. I see a way you can help the human consciousness because if you can understand yourself controlling an avatar, you can understand how yourself actually control you and take care of everything for you and actually make sure that you're good. Because like I tell you, the way it is set up is that the avatar, you literally have everything where you do, the avatar can do in the 3D. It's it just crazy. I don't know if you can find some, a lot of articles online about it, man. We can watch some articles and do some research about the metaverse. That thing is like a tr literally a 3D version of the internet. We have a little 3D self, a little avatar, a control, and everything. And it'll be you. You can go anywhere with it. And you can feel everything what it feels. You can experience everything what it experiences, and all of that. And 
is just literally a lower version of yourself and you know, collected through mind, through the glasses, which is through the brain. So you find that everything everything is mental, life is mental, and if you can understand that as a whole, which is human consciousness, they're gonna help you and go further in everything. Big up the journey YouTube channel, one love.